Hello, in front of me I have TicWatch Pro 3 Ultra and I'm gonna show you how to pair this watch with the Android phone. First thing you will need to do is to turn on the watch and you can turn it on by pressing and holding the upper button and keep holding it until you see the TicWatch logo on the screen. Once you see the logo, you can release the button and wait until the watch turns on. Once the watch turns on, you should see the tab to begin message on the screen. So let's tap on the screen to continue. And after that, you should see the list of languages on the screen. You can scroll through this list by swiping up and down on the screen. Now, find the language you like to use on your watch and then tap on it to select it. I'm gonna select English. So let's go tap on it. And after you select the language, you will get the uh, terms of use on the screen, you can scroll down and tap on I've read it button to continue. And now we need to download and install the Wear OS application on our phone. So let's go to our phone, open the Google Play Store. In the store, let's tap on the search, type in Wear OS and tap on the search button. You should see this application Wear OS by Google with this icon. Now let's tap on the install button to download and install it. And after the application is done installing, you can tap on the open button to open it. In the application you should see this screen. Now tap on the start setup. Here tap on agree. Right here we can agree to send the diagnostic reports to Google if you want to. You can tap on agree. If you don't care, you can tap on no thanks. And the app should start looking for the nearby devices and it should find your TicWatch Pro 3 Ultra. Tap on it to select it. Tap on pair. Right here we can copy Google account from our phone to our watch and it will allow you to use uh, basically Google services on your watch like Google Play Store, uh, Gmail and stuff like that. If you want to copy the account, make sure that the switch next to it is flicked on and then you can tap on next. If you don't care, you, you want to skip this step, you can tap on the skip button. I'm gonna copy one, so I'm gonna select this one and tap on next. Here, let's tap on copy. Now we need to enter the password to confirm. So tap right here and enter the password. and then tap on sign in. Right here we can connect our watch to Wi-Fi. If you want to connect it to Wi-Fi, tap on connect. If you don't want to, tap on skip. 
I'm just gonna tap on connect. Next, we can uh, allow the permissions uh, to uh, use the calls and messages and stuff like that on our watch. Basically, if you want to see the messages and reply to them, uh, see the calls and pick them up on your watch, you need to allow a couple of permissions. And if you want to use this, these features, tap on next. Uh, if you don't care and you don't want to use these features, tap on skip. I'm gonna tap on next and allow the required permissions like this. Next, we have the calendar permission. So basically, if you want to use the um, events or see the events on your watch and stuff like that, you need to allow the permission. If you don't want to, you can tap on skip. I'm gonna tap on next, tap on allow. And the last permission is the notifications. So basically, if you want to receive the notifications from your phone on your watch, you need to allow the permission. If you don't, ca don't care, you can tap on skip to skip this. I'm gonna tap on allow though and tap on allow to confirm. Then tap on next, then tap on done. And you should see the device page for your TicWatch Pro 3 Ultra. Also, your watch should be soon ready to use, but as you can see, the setup is still being uh, complete. And once you see you are all set, the watch should be ready to use. Sometimes you will get the tutorial, you can tap on start tutorial to see it, or you can tap on later to skip it. And then you should be able to use your watch like this. Okay, so that's how you pair this watch with the Android phone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.